Welcome to Strength in Gaming. My name's Samson Lancaster, and joining me today we have Salvador Madrigal. <laughs> How's it going, guys? How's it going, guys? Shut up, Sal. And <laughs> Cat Motherfucker McGuire. Yo! <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding, guys. Just April kidding. Fools. This is this is our April Fools episode. I'm actually I'm Samson Lancaster, actual <laughs> Samson Lancaster, and today I'm joined with Cat McGuire. Hey, how's it going? And Subliminality is joining us once again. Hi. And Sal couldn't make it this episode. Um, no, no April Fools joke intended, but uh, power went out, so that sucks. But, um, you know, we're going to we're going to just continue on. So a lot of a lot of stuff, not really not a lot of stuff, but it's some stuff, <laughs> some stuff happens. Um, but uh, yeah, some Kat, stuff happened. Why, <laughs> Kat, why don't you uh, get us started with uh, the first April Fool's joke that we have? It's one of your favorite games. Yeah. So uh Hunt is introducing uh, Legends of Crytek, a new Hunt Showdown expansion that'll give you the uh, favorite characters from Crisis, The Climb, Rise, Son of Rome as legendary hunters in the game. Nice. I'll buy those. I don't Hell those fucking games. yeah. I don't even play those other games, but I like, I like, I like uh, legendary hunter skins and stuff. Dude, you just do VR with The Climb. In, in Hunt Showdown. I might actually play <laughs> Hunt Showdown now. Just because of this. <laughs> oh, it's so confusing. Um, <laughs> <laughs> well, Subly, I mean, you know, you don't PvP, so it's an interesting thing that you'd be interested yeah. in such a game. Yeah, yeah. I mean, but the Crytek. <laughs> I mean, we've had... We've, I gotta have had. it. We've had we've we've had you play some PvP in the past. I don't remember. Uh, I played what, Dead by Daylight. Yeah, DBD. That is that is PvP. All of us play yeah. DBD. That is, that is definitely PvP. It's it's isometric, very very isometric, but um, it's you know it's a little different. And you you, you never played the killer either, which is where no. it's at. You yeah, uh -uh. that's something you should. Uh -uh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so confused though, Subly. I thought your favorite killer was Nurse. But you don't even play Hunt. Wait, I don't play Hunt, <laughs> but Nurse is my favorite killer in DVD. That's what I thought you said a long time ago. It was probably a past episode. I don't know. I, I think my wire's a little crossed here. So um, Eve, Eve Online, which is a game that I play way too much of. Um, and I was actually <laughs> streaming right before we recorded this show or we started to record this show um they they released an on an online dating app uh god damn it. hold on <laughs> Cat got your tongue edit divinity social <laughs> which is an online dating app for eve online players because you know you really need a better way to get catfished. <laughs> <laughs> now, one of the things I want to point out about this, which is I think is hilarious, is that corporate corporate Jesus Christ corporate espionage is a real thing in the game. Scamming is a real thing in the game. Catfishing is just like a spy's normal Tuesday afternoon. So. A dating app would be ridiculous. Like, I, I feel like there's legal problems there if they do this. You know, like, I mean, I mean, I don't know. You have similar, you have similar interests. If yes, uh... no, but what I'm saying, what I'm, what I'm saying, Subly, is that if if you're, I mean, I know neither of you um, play Eve Online, but it's hard to explain. <gasps> no, it's spy. No, Being a spy is is um is meta it goes outside of the game uh sometimes and this is just really <laughs> inviting that to be like to i mean i've kind of problem. always wanted to be a spy i'm not gonna lie yeah well um you know i mean i'm not a spy never never i've never been a no spy. of course not anybody's talking about then this isn't actually an april fool's 
show. This is all real. This it's is so all real. real. It's just no fake news here. No <laughs> real news only. No, no fake news here, but hundred percent truth. Subway, you do have some more real news that I think Prem <laughs> yeah, might Prem, not be too happy about. Prem is not happy about this at all. He's devastated because he's Polish. And uh, we we hate to see our Polish friend so sad. I don't know how to take that. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, looks like Henry Cavill is stepping down as the Witcher. I guess he's just he's got too much going on. That silly boy. Who are they gonna recast though? I I, I remember there were rumors. There were rumors like maybe Matt Bomer. I think they're just rumors, but I mean, Matt Bomer would make sense because they both look like Superman. You know what I'm saying? They both have that Superman jawline. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're yeah, both yeah, gorgeous, yeah. gorgeous. Yes. Men. Did uh, I see something that maybe Henry Cavill dropped it because, like, he's gonna be the villain in another Superman movie show or something like that? I think I saw guy. that somewhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Lex like Luthor. Luthor. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Which, I mean, come on. Come on, Henry. You know, you're the Witcher. Why would you leave? Why would you do us dirty like that? I'm no. very upset with you. And... I can see him as Lex, though. I mean, I guess, but... <laughs> but um, I'm also mad at you because you made Prem mad, so... Not cool. <laughs> I know, and I need more scenes of him in the bathtub. Oh. Yeah. Yes, okay. be hydrated in the bathtub. <laughs> yes. Yes, with rose petals and and um, uh, <laughs> I need yes, gear waiting on him hand and foot. Yes. <laughs> I need more Henry Cavill on the brink of death from dehydration in a bathtub. I mean, side note, I really liked that meme where <laughs> where it was like I watched Witcher for the the um, the storyline, and then it like says the storyline, and it's just Henry Cavill shirtless, ripped, and then yes, gear shirtless, ripped. I don't know. But also. Also, that. I watch it for Yaskier's memeable faces in memeable the show. Faces. Yes. <laughs> and and his uh, his awesome fucking um bardic tales, his uh his his uh oh my god, what's the word? Oh ballads. There we go. His yeah. epic ballads. Yeah. Um like toss a coin and stuff like that. Oh, I could get down with some Yaskier for sure. For oh sure. hell yeah. Yeah. Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well there was some news though however that i don't know if you ladies will be very happy about um it comes from spike's favorite movie franchise uh the new the new batman what is it called it's, it's just called the batman right the batman, the batman it's just yep. called the batman and it's like five hours long Correct me if I'm wrong. <laughs> it's seven, like, seven, actually. Seven, seven, yeah, seven. seven. Okay, but sorry. like it only My feels bad. like like two, you know. But yeah. uh, I'm sorry, but Robert Pattinson, he had something else he had to do. He's gonna he's gonna leave the franchise, and no. um, the God. best Batman is going Damn to come it. back. Ben Affleck, Batfleck is the best at Batman. I can't even say that. I'm sorry, I can't I say that. Scared the face. dog. I I I I I didn't particularly care for Poor Lily like either. <laughs> Why are you smacking Lily? I Dubbing? I I threw That's abusive. I threw my my can in anger and it startled Lily. Speaking of I'm which, sorry. Cat, <laughs> where's where's Suki at? Where's your fluffy back black Suki? Is she sleeping or No, she's busy just chewing up a tennis ball. You know. Tune up tennis. Well, God, that's, that's she loves right. things. Jesus. That's about right. I know. She just would not leave Subway alone when she visited. No, we're best <laughs> friends. Best, yeah, you guys are best friends. I was there. We had, um, uh, we, at least we didn't have the ice cream at the, at the, at that Korean barbecue place. God. God. <laughs> I am Did never eating ice cream there. Okay, Ever. just just I feel like we should tell the story and like guys, this is not. Well, April but I Fools. think I think Kat, I think no 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 I think Cat should tell the story because it was her husband that like I was okay I was sitting there I was sitting there drinking soju minding my own business because there's nothing I can eat at a Korean barbecue place. Right, um, and Andrew but, was sitting next to you, and he was sitting next to me, and turned and around. He, just, he turns around, and he's like, "What the fuck?" 
what? And I'm like, what? What's going on? And I couldn't see anything because I was facing y'all's. Uh, Subley was sitting right across from me, and Cat was sitting across from obviously uh, Andrew. But um, and and you, ladies, you you tell me what you tell the audience what you saw. Yeah. Um, so Andrew got up <laughs> and was like going over and messing with the ice cream stand. Ice cream scoop. And, yeah, the scoop, and he put it in the dishwasher area mm -hmm. for the restaurant and apparently he had seen somebody drop it on the floor go in scoop more ice cream put it in their mouth go scoop more ice cream from the scooper from the yeah. scooper <laughs> yeah they licked it they <laughs> licked it yeah. and then it so like put it back for other people to use and so Andrew so put, put it, it in the like, sink. Put it in the sink. You know, but then like somebody else came over. <laughs> yeah. But somebody else came over and grabbed the spoon out of the sink and went and got more ice cream. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm sorry, Kat. Like, uh, that was my first Korean barbecue experience. And I'm I'm oh, gonna be scarred for life. I'm so oh, sorry, yeah, Flynn. I'm so sorry. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, Kat. I Kat promise does. not all Korean barbecue is like that. <sighs> yeah, no, I don't think so. But we won't mention said play where it is or anything because I don't even remember, anyways. But uh, um, w w there was there was some more um, some news that we reported that that we had that that happened um, recently, and that was um, I don't know if you need well, Subly does not want to play Among Us, right? You, yeah. you, you said, and I. If I re recall correctly, it's a game you don't want to play because it's like I feel like it's worse than PvP um, because it's you have to. You said it was because you have to lie, right? I have to lie, and I'm not good at that. <laughs> and I'm stressed. <laughs> I'm so stressed. But Cat, you've played Among Us, right? Oh my god! Every fucking time, I am the imposter, and I hate it. <laughs> so I hate so it. So you guys really are twins. <laughs> you played you the know, game, it, but it, you hate the game. It feels that way. It, you, feels it sounds that like way. you would hate the game. Um, but uh, they <laughs> they added a what was what was it? Uh, cat a, a, a horse mode? Yeah, you can just horse around. They in, look like they look the like maps. horse. They, so instead of little, little space like aliens, horses. they're in like little horse suits. It's <laughs> oh man. <laughs> That's not sus. That's not sus. Stop horsing around. Sus. Don't be suspicious. Mega sus. Don't, Don't be, be suspicious. suspicious. Don't be suspicious. <laughs> Don't be suspicious. Oh man! And so there was also um, uh, Sonic Sonic Frontiers Collection Edition is coming out, um, and it comes with what looks like a. Uh, let's see here. I'll try to describe what's in the picture. It comes with a, a an original. Uh, game gear, a rubber ducky, a nice little bamboo bucket, um, the mini, the mini Genesis, and both the uh, uh, Sonic Frontiers for Switch and PS5. Shit! And for how much? Uh, oh, and a towel with 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 the uh, with Sonic and as a plushie. I'm a little confused because I don't know if the plushie comes with it. It's not in a little picture, but uh, you know who um, would really enjoy this piece of news is Bubba. Um, oh my god. Yeah. Where, the, where the frick is this guy? I haven't met him yet. Yeah. Well, you know, one of these days you will, because he's one of the founders. Uh, I don't know if you know. No. Subly. Um, no. He's one of the founders. I know nothing. Of the show originally. You know nothing, Jon Snow? <laughs> <laughs> I, I know nothing about early strength and gaming at all. Yeah. Um, but I mean, Cat, on the other hand, she's been here since the third episode, so it's been a long time. It's like eight years, um, but yeah, I remember it was. I think it was the the very first from the very first episode. Bubba was always ragging on Sonic games, and and I think at some point one of the mystery trailers or one of the stupid console games you should play was one of the like Sonic racing games or something like that. Um, and you know he loved to. To sort of like cheekily, is that a word? Cheekily, it is now. It, it cheekily. It is. Uh, uh, it's a word. Know, it's a word. Okay. 
uh, you know, make fun of or, or, or poke fun at uh, Sonic games because that was his thing. Um, you know, maybe once I actually thought about trying to get him back for the show, but I have no idea how to contact the guy. Like he left Facebook. I don't think I ever got his phone number. He was on the show for like three years or something. <laughs> and just poof. And just poof, gone. I mean, that, that, the, the hundred, you know what we need to do that we haven't done in a long time? We had a hundredth episode party where Bubba, Noah, that other creepy guy that hit on Cat, um, Ugh. like on, on the show, or no, <laughs> after you left. Well, wow, that think. sounds interesting. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, but a hundred, the hundredth episode, we had a party here, which I don't know if, if that's, if that's legal yet, uh, COVID wise, but, uh, we, we had a party and, um, um, I don't know where I was. Oh, Bub- Bubba, Bubba was there and we had, we had a really good time. Um, and I think, oh, you know who we had, we had uh, early on in the day because we did like a long show, like, a, um, deal. And, and we, we started with the guys from, uh, um, general failure podcast. Oh, I love them. Really? Yeah, I don't think I've you've ever met them. I've listened to those episodes. Oh, okay. Okay. And they seem very nice. <laughs> They're definitely your type of people, twin. Oh. Hey. I got to meet them. So, um it's been told that Stevo <laughs> has gotten into the music composing business and he's going to be doing directing all the music for the next goat simulator game that's a thing that's a real thing i'm telling you it's a that's thing. a thing okay that's a thing okay so real talk guys we're not a video game podcast anymore um no there's just not enough we're, content we're trying there's there. not enough content anymore so we're, we're changing it up uh I think um, so. I really want to report on this whole um, Oscars debacle. Oh, the the slap. The slap. <laughs> the okay. Oscar slap. <laughs> so I want to point out, though it hasn't actually done anything good for the real world, it has done a lot for the meme world. A lot of really good <laughs> memes have come out of this. But uh, Kat, did you have you seen what happened at the Oscars? I was I wasn't watching the Oscars, um, but immediately after it happened, it was just in it, it was in my it was like that oatmeal meme where everything just comes out of the computer and hits you in the face. Um, yes, yeah, so I didn't just... see it, but um, I saw it later. And yeah. yeah, so Will Smith went up and fucking bitch slapped <laughs> Chris bitch Rock. Slapped. Oh God! <laughs> yeah, that was a that was so. It 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 started off. I felt like first I felt bad for Chris. Then I felt like, um, like I felt like embarrassed for Jada. And I, yeah, and I, and I also felt like I felt like um yeah that that yeah I felt embarrassed for Jada, and then I also felt like that um. Uh, it may be like it had to be staged, right? This is staged. And I and I went in and looked and and I reviewed it myself a couple of times and I was like, no, I I don't think this was staged. But there were some conspiracy theorists out there that said it was staged. Um, but nothing too much like to really back it up. But then I I looked into like the the past of like not 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 Chris and, and Will's history, but uh, Will and Jada's history and I had no idea I had no idea that mm-hmm. they had those marital problems like mm-hmm. I didn't know those, yep. I, I, I don't pay attention to any of this stuff but literally like I don't pay that much attention to celebrities I don't watch TMZ but all of this stuff just hit me in the face on that day <laughs> and I started looking it up and um, it was really cringy I think one of the things I think it was something Sal posted I know it was edited um, to be like, it was like edited to only show the most awkward parts, but it was like this online or like on air t- therapy session between him and Jada. And sure, it could have been edited to make her sound worse than she is, but it really sounded like she was a bitch. 
like like really really like yeah. i mean if you just put the whole like cheating thing aside it's so, it it sounded like it sounded like she made it was like this transcending like finding yourself thing like like that had nothing to do with him at all i don't know it was weird and then i started to think about it and then if you look back and watch again you'll notice that when so the joke in question what happened let me explain really quick what happened uh chris rock was made he first he made a joke about um uh the other guy i just think of his character's name from old no country for old men sugar um what's what's the actor's name um spanish dude javier uh, bardem javier yeah Bar bardem yeah him and his wife were there and i guess they're both up for the same oscar so the first joke that came out chris said was like it's gonna be awkward blah 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 because if he wins or if she wins you know it's just one of those jokes because they both you know they're both up for the same like oscar or whatever but then after that he he makes a a, a joke about uh jada starring in the next gi jane 2 like saying you know like i you know uh gi jane i think it was gi jane 2 will is, is waiting for you or something like that but it was a joke about her alopecia which is one of the reasons well first of all i want to point out the very first article that i read said it said um uh chris rock makes joke about uh jada pinkett smith's autoimmune disease and blah blah and will smith blah 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 you know and i was like that made it sound way more, way it sound worse, worse than it what was. I thought it was. I was like, yeah. oh, that's fucked up. You know, like knee jerk. That's fucked up. I mean, you shouldn't talk about that. And it's still, it's still obviously it's embarrassing. But one of the things that I noticed and, you know, and, and disrespectful, sure. Um, I think the violence was an overreaction. Yes. Um, yeah. For <laughs> screaming, sure. That's assault. Screaming, screaming maybe would have been slight not, still not appropriate for the area but stick like, to the screaming and, and it would have been like okay it would have been a lot thing. less because he did he did scream keep your my wife's name out your fucking mouth um but one of the things that i thought was the best thing ever was if you watch it he makes the gi jane joke will smith laughs and oh, then you, know, you right. see her face and I think it her face if you if you look at it closely it's less it's less embarrassment and more like it's more like oh anger. brother that's a that's a terrible joke yeah that's yeah well I think I thought she she seemed a little pissed too but the point was then he saw her reaction and then it happened you know what I mean like so like um. I don't know how to feel, but but some some of the some of the memes were some of the best. One of my favorite jokes. I I don't know if I posted it in the chat, but um, it said after after learning everything about all their history and stuff, um, it said uh, uh, Jada is going to let him watch so hard tonight. <laughs> 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 Somebody's like, I don't get it. No, I get funny. it. <laughs> that's okay. Somebody's well. That's true. Somebody doesn't. Somebody doesn't really like the 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 dick and fart jokes. We never have. Mm. Yeah. But yeah, it's just it's something between those people and the academy. What do you mean those people? The people involved. Subly. Okay. I was just checking. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was it was it was an interesting. It was. <laughs> I think. Um, the, the worst part of it all is how 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 widespread and how um, popular it was to the world compared to the actual important stuff that's actually going on right now. Yeah. Um, that nobody seems to give a crap about. But uh, I don't like to get political on this show. Or should we? Mm, um, probably not. Probably nah. not. Probably not. Um, but yeah, we don't we don't play video games anymore. We're gonna be uh, strictly a video. We're gonna be a movie review podcast now. I think. Yeah, I fuck think screen, video games. Screen Rant has offered us an exorbitant amount of money to um, just uh, 
there's poaching all of us. We're all going to go over there. We're just and be- now we have to take a break for our sponsor, Raid Shadow Legends. Because <laughs> we well, yeah. sold out. Yes. And we don't care about video games anymore, which is why <laughs> we let Raid <laughs> Shadow Legends sponsor us. Raid Shadow Legends. Dude, that... I mean, I play it every day on the crapper. Oh, my um, God. I can't get know. enough. I am addicted. Jeez. It's just, it's yeah, that ever good. Ever since it, it was, you know, it, it's, it was the only game that, that uh, could actually re- replace Candy Crush for me. Because I was. That's I was a tough one. That's a really heavily, good game to replace. You know what I'm saying? Heavily yep. addicted, heavily into A that. classic, too. Yeah. It is a classic, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I'm just looking at your face. Are you Subway. okay? Yeah, no, I'm fine. Subway. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Actually, no, cat. I'm sorry. No. Yeah. That's too weird to have Subway take us out. Uh, cat, you should, I think, you know, give Rude. us. Rude. Yeah. <laughs> You're new. You're not. You're, you're too not, new. You're too new. I'm not ready don't, yet. Don't you're not ready like yet. You're still episodes. an initiate. I'm I a don't scrub. Know. <laughs> uh, you know. Um, yeah, take take us out the episode. You know, to the to the outro. <laughs> I'll, I'll edit this. I promise. All right, guys. Well, strength gaming. It's been real. Let's go strength and filming. Yeah. <laughs> That's our new title you heard it here first the reveal strength and filming is going to be strength and I, I mean we tried strength and cinema but it just didn't work out um strength and filming makes the most sense so yeah good night you motherfucking viewers movie goers watchers. movie watchers movie goers watchers movie enthusiasts Pop- popcorn eaters yes those things candy enjoyers candy enjoyers <laughs> <laughs> that reminds me of all those those memes where it's like um casual whatever so and so enjoyer and you know hardcore whatever. Ah! <laughs> Funny. elden ring. you know what we all need to play elden ring yeah i still gotta yeah. get through sekiro i still gotta get through sekiro cat still needs to get elden ring i mean you're not gonna hear about it on the next <laughs> episode because we're not playing video games anymore but... i know that's true. I'm trying. Yeah, I'm kind of regretting that decision, but it was a lot of money. It's a I'm lot of money. Lot. So, peace. Bye. Bye. Thank you so much to all the nerds that listened. You can find us at strengthengaming.com or email us at info at strcast.com. time i've played i've been the imposter i was talking to Kat, I don't. Subway. <laughs> god damn Rude. it god damn it edit, <laughs> edit, <this>. edit. <laughs> sorry no, i get heated about among no, but us cats played among us right